Hello, my name's Georgia and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So actually before I start, let's just set you up here. Let's have a chat, shall we? So this is actually my first video of the year. I know we are in the middle of January. So happy new year. I hope you all had a great Christmas. <laughs> and yeah, it's been a, a while since I've filmed a video. And the only reason why I haven't filmed is because I did want to give myself a break after the Black Friday week. I feel like I filmed so much and edited so much in that week. I kind of overdid it a little bit, I think. And then it kind of just became something that not that I didn't enjoy it but I just kind of ran out of ideas and I didn't want to post just anything on my YouTube I wanted to really enjoy filming it and then watching it back myself Um, I don't want to put anything out there that I wouldn't watch when I'm on YouTube myself so um, yeah that was purely the reason why I haven't uploaded in a while because uh, I did actually film two videos and edit two videos before Christmas and now we're supposed to go live over the Christmas period but I watched them back and I don't know I don't know whether I'll upload them or not now because one of them was a like Christmas glow up so I feel like we're far past that so I'm not going to upload that one and the other one I just wasn't feeling so I'm ever so sorry that I haven't uploaded I have actually really missed it so I feel like this is exactly what I needed and um, just have a little bit of a break from filming editing uploading even though I only do want a week I feel like when you've got a full-time job it is trying to fit it in here there and everywhere and yeah I don't know and then obviously the lockdown happened and I just felt like no one wants to see hauls I don't know I feel like I'm not really watching hauls at the moment so I don't know if that's something that you guys would want to see Um, you'd have to let me know but also it's the fact that obviously like we are stuck inside the house and if I'm completely honest I feel like I started YouTube because I would love to do travel vlogs more than anything um, and all of the holidays that I've been on the past few years I just really really wish that I had a camera and I vlogged it all so I could watch it back and that was my intention really I think when I started my channel. This has just got so deep for an intro what the hell sorry if you're new here like this is not normal but i've not filmed in a while so i thought i'd have a quick catch up before we begin but yeah so obviously covid happened and we couldn't travel anywhere so even though i really enjoyed doing the hauls and the videos like this because obviously i won't always be doing travel travel vlogs because i'm only away for a few weeks of the year but i feel like i kind of lost the direction that i wanted to go in i guess we're gonna have to try and find other videos that I thoroughly enjoy doing as well. I do love doing vlogs, but it's just what you guys want to see as well. Like whether you enjoy the hauls more. I am currently on a no spend, no, a spend ban in Jan. Yes, that's what I'm going to call it. A spend ban in Jan. So I'm not actually buying anything in January. So there's going to be absolutely no hauls for the foreseeable future. I feel like they will resume when things open up again, but. Honestly, I haven't bought anything yet and we are on the the 12th of January. This is when I'm filming this. So, yes, there won't be any hauls over the next few videos, but if this is what you prefer watching, then don't worry. They will be coming back soon, just not in January. So, Feb, maybe, but Jan, definitely not. And is there anything else I need to update you on? I have actually started watching the Harry Potter films and I can't believe it's taken me this long to watch them. They've always on the telly, right? And I just feel like they're on. And because they're such a long film, and I always thought it's like, oh, like wizards and things, I've never really been bothered. But then I watched Game of Thrones like two years ago, and I never thought I'd be into that, but that is my favorite series of all time. If you haven't watched it, definitely watch it. And so many people enjoy Harry Potter, so I was like, surely, there's got to be something to it and I've currently just finished the Half Blood Prince I've got two films left to go and I am absolutely loving it so yeah I I'm a big Harry Potter fan to be honest I want to go to Harry Potter World I want to go back to Universal Studios and do all the Harry Potter rides I'm just really glad to be a Harry Potter fan very exciting times 
but i think that's literally everything that i need to update you guys on not that that was a big update but that is where i've been i've not really been doing much really over christmas <laughs> had a nice christmas hope you all did too but yeah so today's video basically after that tangent is basically just going to be trying a few of the tiktok hacks as well as like a, a stay at home vlog with me i feel like the first hack we're going to do is the tortilla wrap the four way tortilla wrap thing you know and then i also want to try the cutting up your bra situation to make it like a nice lacy one rather than the padded bras but I did actually just go through my underwear drawer and I haven't got that many. I think I've only got three that I can potentially cut up and see. So we'll see how that goes because that seems quite exciting. If you have absolutely no idea what I'm on about then just continue watching and hopefully you can take something from this video. If you haven't already seen it on TikTok which I'm sure you have because that is where I spend 95% of my time. I feel like I'm getting quite hungry. It's lunchtime now, so I feel like that is where we should go. We should go make the tortilla wrap. I am gonna go and make this wrap now because I am hungry. Okay, I just realized I haven't actually cooked the chicken yet, which is what I need to do because I'm gonna have chicken, lettuce, tomatoes, all of that jazz. Um, and these are the chicken breasts that I'm going to be using. I feel like you can use anything. I'd like to do like a pulled pork one. I feel like that would be really, really nice. Um, but we're just going to do chicken lettuce, you know, the standard. So I'm going to put that in. And then while that's cooking, I might actually go and do the bra thing. Because I'm a little bit bored today, to be honest. I kind of just want to keep myself occupied. So I'm going to put the chicken in. And then I'll bring my bras down and we can cut them up together. <laughs> Right, okay, so I'm just going to quickly have a quick look on TikTok and see what I've actually got to do. Because all I've really got is a pair of scissors. Not like fabric scissors, just normal standard kitchen scissors. So let me just try and find this video because I don't know what this girl uses. Okay, so this is basically what we're trying to achieve here. Yeah? Okay. So the ones that I've got, I've got a few Primark ones just because obviously if it goes wrong then it doesn't really matter. I've got this one here which is a black Primark one. I feel like that's going to probably look the best because it's got the lace on there. I've got this one and I feel like I'm just going to ruin it. <laughs> if I just take off the actual back and just keep the... I don't think that one's going to work. Yeah, I'm not sure about that one. And then this one... This one is like a weird kind of lace. So I don't think that one's going to look that cute either. But these are literally the only ones we've got. Because all the other ones upstairs are pretty much like just lacy anyway. I don't really have many like padded bras. Is that too much information? Probably. Or maybe the ones are just like plain t-shirt bras that are like the inside material. I don't know why I'm talking to you about my bras but oh well. And excuse the way I look today as well because my hair was not cooperating at all. This fringe situation is it's not going down well in that down. Um so I did put my glasses on but then as you can see the reflection and I am again in my green Grinch tracksuit because I've been wearing this pretty much every single day. It is probably the best thing I think I brought last year because I have been living in this and I do do loads of other colours on Boohoo. If I'll try and link it down below if I can, um, if they've still got it available. But I definitely need to get other colours but obviously I'm not spending it in January so I can't do that. So let's start with the one that i think is going to go well because or do i let's just start with this cheapy one so i don't really wear these anyway so to be honest if this doesn't go right it's fine so i'm just going to cut a uh, try not to stab myself <gasps> Ta -da! right okay um, do i just rip it do you think oh look at the inside look at that right i've got a plastic bag to put all the stuff in because I feel like this is just going to go everywhere and my mum my mum will kill me I don't know why I'm not doing this in my own bedroom I just fancy being downstairs you know I feel like I've spent way too much time in my bedroom this is no one says how hard this is I feel like I'm literally gonna poke a hole right so this is where we are at at the moment that is what is what is happening and I'm not gonna lie to you it's really difficult I hope this is like 
okay to touch it looks like insulation <laughs> for the walls so everyone on instagram was posting about their um the new sex in the city and everyone was getting really excited about it and i was like oh my god i'm really excited about it and then i was like why am i excited about it i've never actually watched an episode i've never watched a film so i feel like that is my lockdown to-do list is to watch the sex in the city episodes is it, a, is it a film? I feel like they do films and a TV show. I might be wrong, but... Oh, you can start to see slowly coming together. Um, yeah, so that's what I've been doing, basically. Just watching films and things I've never really had time to do before. I watched Pretty Woman for the first time last week and thoroughly enjoyed it. Watched The Bodyguard last week, thoroughly enjoyed it. Um, these are films I've never actually watched before. I'm 24 years old. Oh, another thing that happened, I actually got my provisional license. I finally sent for one and it came within like two days and I was really, really excited about it and my boyfriend, she said I'm showing it off as if I passed my driver's test. <laughs> my driving test. <laughs> but I was just so proud to have it. Like, I've never had a form of ID. So then we went straight to the shop and I actually got to use it for the first time because I bought some alcohol and she was like, have you got any ID? And I was like, yeah i'm 24 and i was probably acting like a 17 year old who isn't actually legal but anyway so that's what happened even though i can't do any driving lessons or anything at the moment <gasps> oh okay so there is another layer underneath that there is another layer and then i've kind of took it off there so i need to get underneath that layer as well so yeah that's also something that happened during my month off youtube ah, that looks so nice right okay i'm gonna finish this off and then i will show you the end result hopefully it doesn't take me too long because the chicken's in here for 15 more minutes okay i was doing so well like that is now the that was the before, that was the after, until I made a wrong turn and I've actually cut the mesh. You have to be so careful with this, but honestly, this would be the cutest thing ever. It would have been really cute as well. And I've got two more to go, but <clears throat> sorry, I've got hiccups. Does anyone else get the hiccups all the time? I don't know what I do wrong, but my hiccups, I, I think I get them probably twice a day. That really saddens me because that was looking so cute. I don't think I'm even going to bother doing that one because I have ripped into that one. But how amazing is that? Like this is a bra that I don't even wear. It's really old. And I just think that's such a nice way to spruce it up just a little bit. That would have been adorable if I didn't... Ugh. Now I've got to go to my chicken. It's all going to love it much again. Right, let's just take a food break and then come back and do the others. Okay, so this is what I'm going to be using for my wraps. So I just got these from Lidl, just the normal wraps. I'm going to put some crispy lettuce in, some tomatoes and cheese and then my chicken that I'm just going to get out of the oven now. And hopefully this isn't a disaster and it's actually really nice it looks really nice how can you go wrong with this really you ask why is my voice saying ah? what <clears throat> right i think my voice is back to normal is it i don't know i don't know yes yeah, so the only thing that i don't have that you're supposed to use is like a george foreman style thing and um, to actually toast the tortilla wraps and the only reason why i don't have one is because when my brother moved out he took it with him <laughs> And my mum just hasn't replaced it because we don't really use one, to be honest. So, obviously, that's a step that I will be missing out on. Unless I can fit it in the toaster. Is that a bit, is that going to cause a fire? I might try it in the toaster. I'm going to Google it first because I don't want to blow the house up. But, um, yeah, that is what I'm going to be doing now. Okay, something that I find easier as well is when you're using wraps. <laughs> Look at this, it's like a cooking channel. <laughs> Anyway, um, the tortilla wraps, I put it in the microwave for literally no longer than five seconds and it just makes it easier to fold the wrap rather than, you know, when you've folded it and it's ripped and it all comes out. I mean, that still might happen to me, so, but if it doesn't, then that was my tip. Okay, hi, really weird angle, but it's the only place I could put it. 
Um, so I am going to actually cut the tortilla. I know people slice it with a knife, um, but I am too lazy for that. So here goes with it. I'm kind of just going to judge where. Okay, we have our little little slip thing. Right, I'm going to put in some. I don't really want to overdo it, and I think I might make two like smaller ones because this tortilla wrap isn't the biggest. So I'm just going to put a little bit of crunchy in there. Get some carrots in there. And then do I grate the cheese or do I slice the cheese? I'm going to grate the cheese. Does anyone else have a cheese grater that is literally the same size of your head? I do not know why we have a cheese grater that is that big, but. You know what this actually looks really nice the only thing is is the fact that i don't like sauces so i'm not going to be putting like any mayonnaise or salad cream or anything i don't know what people have these days i'm literally just going to have this i'll just show you how what i've done now i'm going to have it dry and i mean wow look at this fantastic right i don't know if i'm going to be able to do this one-handed but we fold actually so we fold the wrap oh my god if this actually stays together i am so proud of myself <gasps> okay right i'm gonna have to put the camera down i mean it doesn't look that bad i don't think i mean we lost a few pieces of i feel like i should do taste this shall i put this in the i feel like everything's gonna fall out if i keep it in the what am I trying to say? Get your words out. Um, the toaster. So I'm just going to leave it at that. And then if that doesn't fill me up, I will have another one because I have my another chicken piece. So I'm just going to go and eat this now and I'll let you know how it goes. Right. Taste test. Are we all ready? I'm, I'm very excited, but I'm also nervous. Right, let's... Just... Cheers. Mmm. This is actually so good. And so, so easy. But I just prefer this to a sandwich. And one bite in and rubbing it. I'm going to finish this, watch a little bit of YouTube, and then come back and give you my final thoughts. Get some chicken. Come on then. Some chicken. Come on then. Come on. Okay, so none of you have met my dog yet. This is Marley. Hey, come here then. She's like, why are you giving me chicken on the sofa? Don't tell mummy. Does anyone else also like leave a little tiny bit of their meal um, for their dog? No, look, it's here. Say hi to the camera. Say hello to the camera. Okay then, you're gonna have to sit. <clears throat> oh, baby girl. Yeah, so basically she um, hasn't been on this channel yet. <laughs> wanna say hi? You wanna say hello? Mm. This is Say hi. Say hi. <laughs> She's so cute. She's literally the cutest little puppy girl in the world. Excuse my dog voice as well. <laughs> um, I also had two of those wraps because they were just delicious and I'm starving, wasn't I? Oh, seriously. Literally, you just need to look at this baby girl. Don't get camera shy. Uh, it's because you want the plate. Okay, no, you're not having that. You're not having that. But yeah, I'm going to get back to the bra situation now so yeah 10 out of 10 for those wraps i highly recommend you go out one yourself and i think that was quite a healthy lunch and i am really really full so yeah definitely recommend okay hello i'm back it has dramatically gone darker outside so i'm so sorry about the lighting but we are back and we are doing the bras all right we're just gonna do the black ones so i'm just gonna give this black one a go because this one's a bit more for the lacy lace detail um so wish me luck let's get snipping okay so you know when on like blue peter or art attack or whatever they'd say like you need to get the help of a parent or guardian i think i need the help of a parent or guardian i mean it makes a big mess as well so just be warned you need a bin bag you need a lot of patience which i actually thought i had but this is testing me. I mean, I am going to try and complete the whole thing because if I don't complete this whole thing, then this is just all for a waste of time. So I will actually just come back when this is done because I don't know if you're as frustrated as I am with this, but we shall see. Okay, I, 
I think I'm done. Look at that. That is literally so pretty. I didn't get a hole in it either. It's just really nice. I am really, really, really impressed. It's actually been quite fun. Um, it took me a lot longer than expected. And to be fair, you can just buy them without the padding in and it looks probably a lot neater um, but for any old bras or anything that you're going to throw away anyway that's probably quite a good trick just to see what it looks like without the padding in um, because it does look like a completely different bra so yeah I enjoy that one I'd give that one a 7 out of 10 if you're bored and you want something to do in lockdown because I feel like if it wasn't lockdown I probably wouldn't bother doing it so I might as well just end the video here because I've got nothing else to do um, I just want to say thank you so much if you did get to this point and you've watched the entire video then thank you um, let me know if you enjoy it if this is the kind of thing that you enjoy watching sorry if you can hear Marley she is snoring away Marley Please let me know if this is something that you'd like to see in the future or if you want me to do any more TikTok hacks because that's keeping me occupied at the moment to be honest. And yeah, there will be a video from me as normal every week now and I'm sorry that I didn't upload in a few weeks. We will have a video as normal every Sunday and then if I film anything else I'll upload in the week but you'll definitely be getting one every single Sunday because I don't want to commit to anything if I don't actually commit, you know? So I'm just gonna go get myself a nice little hot chocolate now and sit back and watch maybe the Kardashians or something for the rest of the day. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, then please subscribe to my channel. It really means so much to me and hope to see you in my next video. Bye.